You are about to watch a dissection of the scam around the name John Desmond Hepolette. This is being perpetrated on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, probably other places as well. They've stolen one person's financial credentials and combined them with photos and videos from another person to make a fake John Desmond Hepolette that they are going to use to perpetrate scams. We are going to break down where they got the credentials from and where they got the videos and content for their various social media. Before we do that, I do want to bring up why we are doing this. We are doing this to bring awareness and also with the hopes of getting these sites and social media shut down. It takes effort for scammers to put these together, maybe not a ton, but all the time they're taking to build these pages, post these videos, et cetera, et cetera, is time taken away from actually scamming. And in some cases, they need to expend resources. So if we can get them to expend resources, such as website domains, um, hosting, other things like that, that's great. Uh, we want to make this a less profitable business for them. The success I want to bring up is Emily Lois Parker, emilylois.com. This was our first video. We posted it on January 4th. And now on February 6th, that page is gone. Also, Emily Lois Parker on Twitter is suspended. Did we do that? I don't know, but we definitely tried to do that. And there are still tons of comments on YouTube videos referencing Emily Lois Parker. So future people who would be scammed by that, eventually these top results will fall off and the Reddit and YouTube results of Emily Lois is a scam will show up and these people will be educated that this is a scam. So this is just an all around win. I'm really happy with it. I hope other videos we've done will lead to more pages being taken down and social media being closed. If you look in the comments, I have some other recommendations or suggestions on how you can help us further our goals. If we can just take a couple of these social media accounts down per day, uh, it's just a blip, but it will just take a moment and maybe we can save some people their life savings from getting scammed away from them. Hey. We're going to get to the investigation. Thank you so much for your time. Bye. If financial professionals like John Desmond Hepolet often bring a wealth of knowledge and experience to the table. If we search that name, we come up with an Instagram, a TikTok, and a YouTube. The Instagram has almost 20,000 followers. The TikTok has almost 12,000 followers. And the YouTube channel has 2,000 subscribers, which is pretty impressive uh, because he doesn't have that many views really. But here it says he works for Citigroup and this is a website. That website is down. That's not an active website. So that's kind of interesting. Claiming he works for Citigroup as a licensed and experienced CPA as well as a certified pro financial professional. After working as a consultant at Ernst & Young, Citigroup, blah, blah, blah. 12 videos, 12,000 views. I guess they're shorts, so maybe shorts get more views, but they do not get almost 2,000 subscribers off of 12,000 views. That's just not realistic. If we go and look up John Desmond Hepolet on FINRA Broker Check, which is official, we see Citigroup Global in New York and has previously worked for Solomon reinvest company and Lazard Freras. If we do a search for John Heppelet Citigroup, we come up with this biography. John Heppelet, co-head of the city community capital, began his career at Lazard Freras, that matches. And this is on citigroup.com. So it seems, you know, fairly official. And then here it says, then Salomon Smith Barney, which is very close to what we read here, Salomon Reinvestment Company. So this seems like a an official bio to me. This man is obviously not this man. So we found the real John Desmond Heppelet, and this is a faker. But where did they get these videos from? Where did they get this picture from? If we look up Able Trading, we'll find videos of this guy and similarly able trading uh 
is right here on YouTube. So he's still in the YouTube videos. And he has a much more realistic, they're still impressive, 1.4K subscribers off of 29,000 views. He has abletrading.com. He has a Facebook. This guy is where they got the videos from, where they got the pictures from. And this is John Hepplet, whose credentials are being stolen to further the goals of this fake John Hepplet who, if you interact with him, will get you to go to a website to deposit crypto. And once that money is deposited, it's it's being deposited to invest with him. But if you deposit with him, that crypto money is just gone. I guarantee it. So uh, yeah, that's the scam. We figured out who the real John Desmond Hepplet is, and we figured out where they got the content for the Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. So that's the scam. If you have time and you can go and uh, report these accounts, that would be great. And if you could upvote this video, like it, maybe even subscribe, leave a comment. It'll help it in the algorithm. So when people are on Google searching for John Desmond Hepplet, instead of finding those other pages, they'll find this video and that can protect them, help them to realize this is a scam and not deposit money to that website. Awesome, hey, thanks for watching. Stay safe out there, bye.